Welcome to Faith in Five, a weekly video devotional designed to discuss practical spiritual concepts in five minutes or less. I'm your host, Mark Vandella. So in the movie Tommy Boy, there is a scene when he is on a little sailboat out in the middle of a lake, and he's trying to have a conversation with his dad. And while he's out there, it's just a completely still day. He's in a sailboat, and there's, there's these little kids, or young kids, on the, on the shore. And they're yelling at him and making fun of him because his ship, his little boat, isn't moving. Now, Tommy Boy's a rather large human, and his boat is small, so it looks kind of funny. And one of the kids yells out, hey, Tubbo, you ain't moving. And Tommy Boy responds and says a couple of things, but then he says, yep, could use a little wind here. And I tell you that because our faith journey is very similar. When it comes to prayer, oftentimes we find ourselves in the middle of a lake, in a boat, trying to do all the work and not asking God for just a little bit of a wind. We work, we work, we work, we work without ever stopping to ask for God to blow. Or the other thing could be true. We could be sitting inside on a windy day asking for wind, but not being willing to go out and do the work and get in the boat and actually sail it. In his book, Why Pray, John DeVries talks about, about this idea that, that prayer and work are the two feet of our faith life. They go hand in hand. He said, let's consider your, your prayer life your right foot and your work life your left. If you kept your left foot firmly planted and you just tried to walk with your right foot, with the prayer foot, you would just walk in circles. And then if you switched it up and, and you tried to use your, your work life and you kept your prayer life firmly planted and didn't do anything, you would walk in circles in the opposite direction. And he said, that's how most of us live We do both of them next to each other, but not at the same time. We go work, 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 work. It doesn't work. And then, unfortunately, our prayer life is the last ditch effort. And then we pray, 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 and hope that God will make miracles happen, which he often does, but but they're really intended to go hand in hand and work foot by foot, side by side. See, in Ephesians 3, 20 through 21, It says that God can do anything far more than you could ever imagine or guess or request in your wildest dreams. He does it not by pushing us around. God doesn't force his way onto us. It says that he does it through his spirit, deeply and gently within us. And the way that we connect with God and his spirit, the way that we better understand what he wants for us and, and where we should be working and how we should be working, the way that these two things go together is through prayer and work. It's kind of the old adage that we should work like it depends on us and pray like it depends on God, but that we can't do either alone. As we wrap up this prayer series, I want us to consider how prayer impacts our lives so deeply and so richly. See, God intended that prayer is to be the means by which we engage together, by the means by which we join him and his work to redeem this world. And that by connecting with God more often, more regularly through prayer, through conversations, we can be more in tune to what he wants and where he wants us to work. And he will show up when we put in the work. So this week, as you go about your faith journey, as you consider all the things we've talked about in this Hey God series, consider how, where you're willing to work, how hard you're willing to work, and whether or not if God shows up and if he answers your prayers, are you willing to go do what he asks you to do? And also be willing to ask for him to show up in those places that you're ready to work hard, the places that you want to see impact, and continue to do those two things together. Begin to walk and dance this beautiful step, left, right, left, right with God, that we do pray and we work together. This week, give it a shot as you wrap up this series on prayer. Thanks for tuning in. If you want to follow us each week, click here to subscribe. And if you want to take it a little bit further, click here for discussion materials.